Hi, good morning all and thank you so much for joining today's exclusive webinar on ProTerminal. My name is Ashish and along with me we have our product manager Sony. Hi everyone. And uh, today we will be discussing in detail on ProTerminal and the new added features that we have uh, come up with which will definitely be of use, right? So now I was also going through the questions and first of all again thank you so much for the overwhelming response that our viewers and customers are providing us. And uh, as I can see, the maximum questions that was asked about was uh, how to activate Pro Terminal, how to use Pro Terminal, what are the additional advantages if I start using it, and I already have, but I don't know how to use. Is there any specific charges? How to subscribe? So let me tell you how to subscribe if you don't have Pro Terminal activated. First of all, let me tell you how to see where your Pro Terminal is activated, and then how to get your privilege activated, and what are the charges involved. So over to my computer screen now and I will tell you how to activate the privilege for Pro Terminal. So you just have to log in to uh, www.hdfcsec.com. This is our home page. You have to go to products. Under products, you will see trading platforms. In trading platform, the first option is Pro Terminal. So you just click on it. It will take you to the subscription page. It is exclusively available only for HDFC Securities account holder. Enter your user ID, your password, your date of birth and click on subscribe now. The charges for this is generally 2499 but at present as a special offer price you will get it at 1999 which is valid for 12 months. So once you subscribe for it and the payment is successfully done from your linked savings account, within 48 hours, your Pro Terminal will be activated. So this is how you can activate your Pro Terminal. Now let me tell you where you can check if you have already subscribed or as a part of special promotion or offer you have already got the subscription. So you have to log in by entering your login credential on our Empowered. Once you log in, you can see Home button, Portfolio, Equity, Derivatives. In the same line, the last option you can see as Pro Terminal. If you click on it, and this is how it is, if it is visible to you, that means your Pro Terminal is successfully active. You have the access of Pro Terminal. Now you can start using our Pro Terminal. Now Pro Terminal is an advanced trading platform. With this, you can trade like a pro. Let me tell you what are some specific advantages, what we have out here. Now this watch list section, if you see, this is, we have made a lot of changes in that. This is completely uh, customizable. As per your requirement, you can customize. In fact, there are many predefined watch lists also available out here. So whatever watch list that you have created on Empowered would be displayed under user defined watch lists. And the predefined watch lists are indices watch, NSE equity, NSC, BSC equity, NSC futures, options, and all these things. So if you are looking out for something in that sort, you can just click on it and the respective watch list would be displayed. And then here you have an edit option through which, as I said, it is highly customizable. So you just click on this edit option and you can see the various options available to edit. So under description, what are the options available? You can see there from the price perspective, what all information that you want to be displayed on the watch list as per your requirement you can select so is for trading so these are all the aspects parameters you can select which you want to display under that spe specific sector and then also uh, you can You can also put some symbols and uh, you know you want to know some something wherein uh, specific filters that you are looking out whether it can be on the last traded price or on the change or on the change percentage you can see these details over here so Sony is there anything uh, specific that has been added uh, into this watch list would you like to highlight yes Ashish uh, thank you so we have a new added feature mm -hmm. in this watch list so here under the predefined watch uh, you know watch list that you have if you want to see what are the new added features for example if i'm taking you to the nse futures watch list 
So earlier we used to have the percentage change, the LTP, where you could also place your orders, you know, buy and sell from here itself. So we have all the future FNO stocks, future and option stocks over here. Mm -hmm. The new changes that we've brought into this feature is where you can have the detailed view as per open interest and what kind of day build up is it showing right here in the watch list itself. So it's like all the data under one roof. So you can see there's this open interest percentage change, open interest percentage volume and what day built up. So for example, if you are under the most active button, if you just go and click on open interest gainers, you will get all the open interest gainers under one roof and you can also check out what exact percentage of open interest are they adding and what kind of build up is it showing. So you can see over here, there's a day build up, long build up for mine tree. So this is a new feature that we've added where you will get all the build up and activity, maybe short build up, long build up, short covering. Over here also you can see there's open interest gainers, open interest losers, long build up, short build up, short covering, long unwinding. So you can filter this watch list according to your, uh, you know, according to your comfort and analysis of where you want to see your watch list. So this is a new feature that we've added under watch list, right? Thank you. Right, so this was really interesting. So that's all about the watch list part. And then we have your portfolio, wherein you can see your existing portfolio, your overview on your holding on your portfolio, uh, how it has been appearing, and is there any specific overview on that, any specific research calls on that. You can see here intraday movement, 52 week high, low price gainers, and so on that you can check out here. Uh, then we have a new section. So in this new section now, this is also a prime point uh, out here uh, that I would like to inform to all our viewers that uh, Pro Terminal is, is a platform wherein you get news across the country. Okay, so you get it from various brokerage houses is what they're recommending, uh, what are the analyst views and a lot of real time information news sentiments are displayed out here. So let me just take you through here. So once you click on equity, you can see the streaming news can see the corporate announcements you can see the latest news by sentiments wherein red as negative gray as neutral and green as positive and here this part these are the recommendations so buy recommendations outperform recommendations hold and sell all these informations are provided you just have to maximize all these widgets are in in a small compact manner it is displayed if you wish you can maximize any of them by clicking here and this is how it will be displayed. So these are the recommendations for now, for, for since morning from the brokerages. And these are the recommendations till now from various analysts. So, and the specific news and the views are displayed over here. You can click in on any of them and it will take you to this page. So this will help investor to understand what is going on exactly at this point of time in the market or if you're tracking something specific you can get some more detailed information which will help you again to take more informed decision. So Sony, under this new section also, I would uh, like to know, is there anything new that has been added? Because this was also there earlier. Yes, Ashish, uh, we have two new features added under this news. You can see the last two options that we have. One is my portfolio news, which will give you the news only specific to your portfolio holdings whatever news it could be domestic it could be global any news related to your portfolio holdings you can see it according in this tab and the other that we have added as a new feature is the sentiment heat map whereas if you click on the sentiment heat map you have the various sectors which will show you the sentiment across today's trading market so how it is performing over here is the sentiment so if it is like very deep maroon it will show you like uh, sectors and stock which is trading you know above or more than negative 10 percent if it's a little lighter red version of that uh, color it's in a negative three percent if it's like blood red bright red color it's in a negative 0.1 percent and so on you can see the color clarification uh, classifications in green for positive sectors and if you want to see particularly if any stock in any particular sector is performing in any of these red sentiments. So you can just click on any. For example, if I clicked on pharma, you can see the, uh, you know, active gainers for today's, um, you know, today's uh, active gainers for this particular industry. You can see Sun Pharma, which is in a green color. So it's in a positive sentiment. Fortis is also in the green color. And you can see Sipla, DV's Lab. 
and PEL which are in the grey colour which is like in the neutral zone. So they are neither positive nor very negative. So this is how the uh, new sentiment heat map will show you under the new section. So we have two different uh, features added under this. One is your my portfolio news and another is a sentiment heat map. Right. So moving on. Uh, over to you Ashish. Yeah. So this is really interesting. Uh, at a glance I can take uh, you know I can get to know what is going on in this specific industry. Right. If I am tracking a specific industry I can this would be the best place to see how that particular stocks in that industry are performing. Right. All right, so that is how about the news section again and we have the global markets this was also there earlier so you can have a view onto the global markets also these this is a news view and if you want to have a map view you can see the map view and then we have charting tool uh, this is also ex uh, you know very very much interesting because these are the charts which are real time okay you can see the timings out here you can define the time horizon that you are looking out one minute built up chart you are looking out for three minutes five minutes 15 minutes 30 minutes one hour one day one week and one month so so many options are available on the charting tool and there was one question in fact asked by one of the investor that can i do my transaction from charting tool so uh, sony let me tell you of course we can do a transaction from the charting tool right now this has been by default nifty has been displayed so let's take an example if i want to see of particular script I just need to enter the script name over here. I need to select it and right here you can see it has been displayed and I can buy or I can sell from the chart itself. Okay. So this functionality is available. Then we have, you can select various tools available like crosshair, segment, continuous, ray, line that what you are looking out as per your research or your study you want to do. You can add up additional studies as well like RSI, moving average and so on. These are all displayed over here. As per your requirement, you can put across those studies and you can click on save. So you can save these things as well and you can take more informed decision. Charting tools options also are available. Various charts are available. Line, area, candlestick, which is now displayed, OHLC and all these things are also available. Plus you can add a comparison also if you want to take more informed decision in the specific sector or you want to do it from nifty you can do that so just you need to enter it and uh, this is how it will be displayed so then you will come to know this is how the nifty has been performing and this is how your stock is performing similarly you can do a stock to stock comparison as well if you are tracking any of them and you want to know which one should be the best buy so that also you can do wow this is like really interesting i think people who are into like stock to stock comparison who who would like to you know get under understand the correlation of two stocks and how the stocks have you know moved according to each other because people are you know some people who are into paired kind of trading so i think this is a really useful charting tool for them right so i think this is quite excellent right so and then we have research section here wherein you can see the various screeners accounts this is a demand balance in your stock limit that you can see okay then we have report section this will take to a uh, to empowered okay that is how it is now sony here i have one question in my mind okay i would like to know nowadays our stock market is highly influenced by fii's and dii's uh, movements what they do what they do and in right. fact uh, that also impacts uh, our uh, fno markets as well Certainly. so first question i have in my mind is can I get some information where I can see their movements and how they are performing and what they are doing? And secondly, most importantly, I would also like to know what are the strategies? How should I build the strategy? Because if, if I want to see, this is an advanced trading platform and I am done with equity. Now I want to move towards future and options aggressively. But I would like to know what strategies I should put forward and how this FIIs, DIS, when I hear a news, how they affect and where can I see that data? Do I have to go to the specific website of NACBSC or check the information? That will consume so much of time. So is there any solution to this, Sony? Right, of course. So let me just show it to you. Previously, under this market option, we just had two options called equities and FNO. Mm -hmm. Whereas now, under a new added, newly added features, we have something called overview, heat map, market calendars for both equities and FNO. So when you click on the uh, overview of equities, you would just have a you know heat map of how these stocks are performing according to the percentage, price percentage change. You can see the screeners, you can have a corporate action if there is any corporate action for any stock, there's a news pulse and everything. 
So this is same for what we have as a heat map. It would just show you this, this, this is a heat map where it will show you the top gainers and the top losers, right? And the calendar is what would show you the corporate action of all these stocks. If there are any corporate action for any stock, they would show you under which date and which stock is being affected. Similarly, we have it for FNO also. So if you click on the FNO, obviously, because we know at that derivatives market has more data to offer than, you know, than, and then uh, the equities cash market that can. Mm -hmm. So in, in FNO market, if you click on the overview, you would have a very detailed view and a lot of interesting things that you can understand from this. Mm -hmm. So we under the heat map, you don't just have a classic clarification of uh, you know classification of the stocks according to the price change price percentage change only we also have it according to the open interest change so it will show you the stocks that are in green so the stocks will show you that it's a long built up stock happening because this heat map is showing you the stocks from the highest open interest to the lowest open interest so if it's all green it is a long built up kind of a stock over here you can see there are different color class uh, you know color classification green is for long built up blue is for short covering orange is for long unwinding red is for short built up and gray is for neutral so you can see so if it's a green mine tree you can see and if you place a cursor on mine tree you can also have a small tap up that's coming up where you can see what how much percentage has mine tree moved under future and option segment and what kind of open interest it has added if you can see over here there's a 13.55 percent open interest showing so these are the top gainers according to price as well as open interest as well so this is a latest feature that we have a heat map if you only want to see long built up stocks you can click on long built up you'll see all these stocks that are fresh forming witnessing fresh longs similar for short covering long unwinding and short built up stocks also so i think this is very useful where you can get an idea of which kind of what you know the stocks how what kind of uh, build up that they're showing and how they're going to perform similar you also have these screeners over here that you can filter it according to most active volume gainers price gainers volume losers and you can get the details you also have the similar fno pulse that will show you any kind of unusual activity happening in any kind any any particular FNO stock and the previous additional the, the previous uh, unique feature that we had something called a 15 minute long built up so 15 minutes uh, built up strategy is still there writers with us so this is the uh, you know if you just expand on it it's still the same where every 15 minutes you would get an idea whether the stock has formed a fresh long or a fresh short so this is very useful for intraday trading to understand the trend of the stock for the particular day. 15 minute build up is useful for that particular uh, intraday uh, trend. You can also have the comparison according to the price zone. So for example, from 9.15 to 9.30, this particular stock or index had shown a long build up activity in this price range. And you can also see how many contracts have formed in this. So, you know, it's very useful because not only you get to understand how many fresh contracts or open contracts are being formed in which price zone, but which activity is being formed. So I think it, it's going to be very useful for intraday traders who like to understand the trend of that particular stock. So it is available for all these stocks. So you can just click on any of the stock and they'll, it, it will take you to the detailed view. So, for example, if I click on mine tree, here is where you're going to the detailed view. Right, so this is how it shows. Right, so here we have overviews done. So heat map is what I've already shown you. Now under market, you have summary, FI and D activity. I think Ashish, this is what you were trying to ask, understand. Yes, yes. What the big guys are doing in the market. Right. What is it that they are doing and how we can track them. True. Let me tell you, first of all, this data, if you just click on it, it is mm -hmm. easily available with us. But it is also available in the NSE website. Okay. Very easily available because this is very important data. You can just, you can go to markets, you can click on the FI and DI activity and you'll get all the activities that they have from month wise. And if you want date wise, click on a particular month. You'll get it according to each date. Now this is FIs only. So I've clicked on August, you'll get all the August or separate date wise also you can get the data. If you want to further understand what kind of or how much 
volume or how much open interest have these big guys traded in to understand you can click on it and you get the ex detailed data on, on it this is really fantastic sony i mean to say rather than going on nse website and doing and uh, in, you know investing my time there i think this is available right here and uh, just in few clicks i get the information exactly and this is also going to tell you how much long and short have been built so you know mm -hmm. uh, you don't have to exactly go to nse and like do the calculations yourself because it's readily presentable available to you right over here so you can have the fi's uh, data di's data maybe activity what kind of activity they are doing stock futures index futures beat volume beat open interest so you have all the data over here you want to understand equity market the cash market you have to just go in the similar way and here the data is already readily available to you date wise month wise every data is available whichever month whichever date you want to go you can just click on it and you'll get the entire series entire months data readily available so this is the uh, way to understand similar is for the di's as well di's obviously we know that it's the domestic uh, you know like equity cash uh, investment so you can just go and similar you'll have it over here also you click on any one month you'll get the date wise detail every day's data and activity how it has been formed so this is where you will get the detailed activities of the fis and uh, di's that's really fantastic so this was also there with us before but now also we've highlighted in a much more uh, you know prominent way so we also have something called unusual activity where uh, different queries, predefined queries are already built up by this software already. So mm -hmm. you don't have to go and apply your own brains and you know rack it out and understand how to do it. So it's already pre-built for you. Mm -hmm. We have the different tabs also for you. So if you are understanding a bullish, bearish, neutral, breakout, volatility, whatever tab you understand, whatever tab you want to find out which stock is performing, under which tab you can just go and click. Maybe if I want to understand, you know, breakouts, simple. So any stock that I is trading at 52 week high. I click on it and it will give me the list of all these stocks. It can be FNO stocks, it can be cash stocks, it can be all the stocks that has given a fresh 52 week breakout. So instead of going and you know plotting it in the charts by yourself or downloading the data from any site, here is directly where you could just go and click on anything. Maybe, maybe a bullish stock, maybe I want to understand uh, you know unusual call volume today. For example, so if I just click on it, it will show me all the data, all the stocks that are under this bullish query itself. So here I can understand, I can see the stocks, I can click on it and I can see the trend. So this is another unusual activity feature that we have. Absolutely. Right, so we also have sector wise, we have advanced decline ratio of the stocks, we have intraday deals which will tell you any unusual deal happening in any particular stock for the day. So that will show you, we have the option chain which was already there with us earlier. Now we have only classified it by color differentiation where you can see all the grayish, the darker grayish area is your in the money call options and put options and your, uh, you know, the, the brighter uh, or the whiter portion of the option change that you see is your out of the money options. So this is what new classification we have done. Obviously, if you want to trade under any of these strike prices, you can directly select one strike price. If you want to buy or sell the options, you can just trade it over here. Maybe call option or maybe put option. Either of the things that you can do. Right. So this is this was also obviously already there. Screener is something that we have newly. It's a new added feature. It's very important. We're trying to highlight so you can see over here. The screener is more like an alert, more like a query predefined, pre-built for us. So any stock that is showing any kind of an important message, maybe a crossing above pivot, maybe a breaking of the resistance level, maybe resistance one, resistance two, you can just see. So here, for example, if you're seeing NBCC breaking resistance one of 73.28, the last rated price is 74.9. Here, this green, greenish kind of a symbol is showing that it's a bullish kind of a, uh, you know, trend. You can see which sector it belongs to and this is the various levels. So even if you don't know how to read charts, you can just come to this screener. You can see that it is breaking the resistance 1. The next resistance 2 is going to 73.92, resistance 3, 74.93. So it is reaching 74.9. So the more resistance levels it breaks, the higher it is going. Like it's forming a bullish sentiment. So this is how we can go in different 
screeners for us so whichever stock is forming whichever important alert this that that particular alert gets highlighted over here by default for you you want to understand the separate different levels you have over here resistance one resistance two resistance three support one support two support three which level at which level it can take a support at which level it can face a resistance so you already have predefined levels for you even if you don't understand charts so if you want to you can just click on it and analyze it according to chart so this will help you to understand a charting technique charting tool all by yourself and you see this is real time data this is real time so it keeps on moving up it keeps on giving you fresh data anything that's happened so this is a new thing screener and one more thing just i sorry to interrupt you suni yeah. here i just saw few pop ups 52 week high right so these pop ups are also coming up as in when the activity is created absolutely so yes. that you know i can be stay updated so that is something really great that alert and that pop up is coming of that unusual activity right so that is also in a real time data and the last important that we have in a newly added feature is a future rollover now as we know rollover means squaring off your position for this contract and taking a similar position in the next contract because you are having a view that the particular stock can perform a little better so this is what rollovers been now rollover data is were available in nse site but obviously uh, you know you had to go and download those bhav copies and it was a tedious process you had to put in your own formulas understand how the rollovers has happened you need to have a past data also to compare but now you don't need to go through that tedious process because for the very first time in a very unique fashion we have we are presenting it to you in pro terminal itself where you'll get the rollover data of all these stocks of today's rollover the previous day's rollover and to make it more easy for you we are also giving you a comparison of a 3 months average rollover so very simple you just need to understand if today's rollover is higher than a, your average rollover and the price is also or the trend is also positive it is forming like a bullish sentiment so this is how rollovers are done obviously like there are a little more details into rollovers to understand it we would be conducting a series of webinars for to understand uh, all about derivatives especially its important parameters and indicators where we would be covering this rollover parameter as well so if you want to understand how to understand and analyze a rollover as an important parameter we request you to join that webinar session where you can have a detailed session and uh, understanding of that particular parameter but this data is readily available over your writer so you don't need to go into nse anymore and do the calculations by yourself and much easy is where we also giving you a built up according to it so you can not only see the rollovers if your rollover is higher than the average rollover for today but we're also showing you whether the price or the trend is positive or negative and according to what kind of built up is what kind of activity is happening in that particular so this is another important uh, you know very very unique and for the first time we have something in a uh, pro terminal that we've been right. i need to say these details are so much calculations are required and so much stress you have to put in order to by the time i'm done with it the maybe the price have moved right so the, i guess this is right away available and something really exclusive and a fantastic tool for all our investors i mean to say it is worth to purchase this software absolutely and if you want to understand you you can just you know you can attend a webinar session on the web, you know derivatives rollover important parameters and you would understand how to analyze rollover it it'll, it's not very rocket science for anyone to understand it's very in interesting also right right so moving on we have we'll take you to the next where we have a strategies now you don't have to be an expert in options trading to understand the greeks mm -hmm. you don't need to understand the greeks or you know the details of what kind of strategy should you do maybe you just a layman but you want to get into some kind of strategy front right so for that we are providing you something called as a strategy input all mm -hmm. you need to do is just have a target for your stock mm -hmm. just a target a view that you may have if the stock is going to move up or the stock is going to move down or the stock is going to remain in that particular zone that's all you need to do mm -hmm. for example hypothetically if i have to find out a particular strategy and i will give you a target of for example i'm not saying the 11500 600 okay this is hypothetical example so i've put in 11600 is my target my target date you can change it if you want by today i'm expecting the stock or this index to move to 11600 
or am I expecting maybe like you know in two three trading sessions it will move so if I click by 21st August maybe I have a few two three days movement wait and then the you know this particular stock can move up to 11,600 so if I have applied my target and my target date all I have to do is click here and the software is going to have predefined auto calculated strategies for you you don't have to understand you don't have to apply your and rack your own brains what kind of strategy to do so it's very simple you can get three strategies sometimes you can get two strategies one strategy as well each strategy will have the action required so you can over here like it's writing buy one nifty 11,500 call what premium it is also writing you have to sell one nifty 11,550 call and it's writing you the premium so this is the strategy that you have to execute both the legs it will also calculate the risk reward ratio for you the probability of having a profit till my target date my target date was 21st august so my prof like the probability of entering into a profit for this particular strategy is 82 percent what is my maximum profit that also gets calculated for me 2088 per lot is my maximum profit that i can gain what is my maximum loss 1600 1653 rupees 54 rupees is my maximum loss that i can gain so it is almost like a 1 to 1.5 percent of risk reward ratio it is also calculating my first break even point that by before my target date that is 21st august if i cross this break even point my strategy will give a profit or a loss according and how many days left for expiry that also it's writing and it is also showing me a risk reward ratio a risk profile of in form of a diagram it's a payoff diagram so you can see if it's red this is your disadvantage we have something called of your disadvantage which is your capped reward whereas benefits is your capped risk how much is my risk reward ratio so overall risk profile and reward profile is what it is capping and showing in this particular diagram so easy so you can see a different levels of the stock or the index that I have the price is showing 10,369 if market breaks down to 10,369 my loss would be only 1,654 rupees oh that is also displayed over here absolutely so your total profit loss your theoretical PNL obviously because you haven't executed it's right. unrealized right. so it's a theoretical profit loss and at what level of that particular stock or the index how much profit or loss you can have so you can see break even as we said is 439 so the moment it crosses you can see your profit starts to increase and at what level are you having the maximum profit you can see over here 2088 2087 remains a pro maximum profit at what levels maybe 12,000 13,000 14,000 whatever level it moves. so this is a risk reward ratio so similar if you're not comfortable with this you can scroll through different different kind of strategies so this this strategy input that we have is a predefined pre-calculated auto calculated strategy front for you so we don't need to rack our brains anymore you know call up a few people understand what kind of strategy should should we do mm -hmm. we just need to have a target date with us and a target price click on it and do be done so this is how it is this easy to understand strategies risk reward ratio everything right so you can get it all under this market tab so we have new features overview you can get the heat map of it you can understand the market summary fis di's activities any kind of unusual activity maybe intraday deals option chain screeners not to forget most important and unique feature that we've added is a rollover page you can get an indices view all the indices together and this really good strategy calculator for us right. right so this is all the new features that we have mm -hmm. added and i think it's quite uh, you know it, it's become quite advanced very easy comfort and obviously you can trade it at, at your own ease right so right. over to you ashish yeah now i will also quickly explain about the get code page that what all informations are available out here because there was one question asked by one of our investor that uh, i want to know the detailed information of the particular script in one page can i get that so answer to that is yes you can get once you click uh, the get code uh, pay link is here you just have to enter the script name like just now i've entered acc and right here in this section you can see the equity part wherein you can directly buy and sell from here you can see the high and the lows 52 week high and lows previous closes and also importantly you can see the health score also 
So this is also an added feature, Sony, that we have uh, we have come across, yes. right? So this health score has been uh, there is a predefined parameters on the basis of that the scores are uh, put across. Right. right. Yes. So when it is nearer, closest to the hundred, that means it is considered to be. It is a kind of a considered analysis we right. do. So you know, you, it 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 will show you the health score, and you can also have a comparison of this stock. According uh, in in the same industry with different stocks, like a peer comparison is what you can do, right? And understand how that stock in that same industry is performing as a health score. Right. So if this stock is having a better health score, or your peer industries are having a better health score, so right. this is what the peer comparison does for you. And you also have a grid over here where you know these blue dots that you can see if you just place a cursor on it, you would show in this particular industry. According to this ACC, how the other peers are comparing. So we have four different quadrants over here, and which stock is placed in which quadrant? What These are the all the peers, right? Yes, absolutely. All all the peers in this particular industry, like different different stocks and how and where this this particular stock is placed. Maybe it's an excellent quality, overvalued stock. So what kind of a quadrant it's placed at? So this is how a peer comparison can be done. That's really fantastic. And from here itself, I can see the available contracts, right? I can see uh, the future and options yes. contracts. So from here, I can select if I want to make a future, uh, I want to do it or I want to do it in options and which specific contract. And uh, I can click on either on get code or I can click on buy or a sell right from here. So right. this is the equity part and this is the mutual, uh, this is the future and options part. So in the same page, you can get that. And in fact, of individual stocks as you were talking earlier the built up strategy we can it can be displayed over here and if i want to maximize these are all the widgets i just need to click on expand and i can see the expanded version of it yes and the available open interest and the price across expiry and the premium discount information all these details are displayed over here which makes uh, you know which actually help me to take more informed decision so much of information is available at the single screen itself and the fno pulse related to acc would be displayed in this section absolutely i think it's quite worth it don't you think so ashish of course of course i mean to say the more and more i explore it i can i can find so many things available which could be useful there are all the detailed information whether i want to see the financials whatever i've gone through but i need to cross verify with their financials how this particular uh, company is going i can see the financials i can see their balance sheet i can see see the cash flow their pnl account their ratios so these are very important information one uh, as in one professional investor would like to have a look before he makes a decision right and i think this is quite user friendly also right there's no rocket science that you know you you actually uh, can scroll through the pro terminal and you know fiddle with it maybe like a day or two at your own ease and you can understand things on your own it's right. like very easy very user friendly that we have true and the strategy is also in the specific stock if we are looking at the strat you can do it right here so no need to go uh, every time on the strategy and put across if you're looking out any particular script and on that you want to place a strategy and you want to know what needs to be done so you just have to click here on strategies and the strategies are defined as you have just explained so here you can see uh, sony now it is displayed bull call spread and bull call spread both the both the calls are on a bull call spread right Right, so I think this is what I was talking about, like so user friendly, like under one screen and under one roof, you're getting all the informations available to you, easily available. Right, so now let me just uh, inform to our investors that uh, we are also coming up with more sessions of Pro Terminal. So after this session, if you have some further queries or questions that you want to know about it, you can definitely place uh, and we will be answering that in the next session as well. And in fact, any of our viewers who have missed it right now, so just want to, or who have just now joined for their information, we're going to have this session again today at 4.30 p.m. Right. And let me just quickly show how you can uh, make a buy or a sell uh, on this particular section. So if I'm going uh, a future contract, I'm buying of this particular clip, I, all I have to do is just click on buy. All the details are auto-populated. I just have to select my lot size and my price type, whether it may be market or limit, and click on place order. And that's my order would be placed. Right. right. I can do it margin. I can do it uh, intraday, intraday as well. Perfect. Or cover. Yeah. Right. I guess with this, we have done with our pro terminal uh, know-how, a basic know-how. And uh, now we are open for question and answers. So viewers, if you have any specific uh, questions, please ask. We'll be happy to answer.
ओके सो दी फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन वी हैव इज फ्रॉम मिस्टर मनोज कांति दत्ता वॉट पर्पज विल बी सर्व एंड बेनिफिट वुड बी डिराइव एंड फीचर्स इफ आई सब्सक्राइब टू प्रो टर्मिनल मॉड्यूल एंड आई डो नॉट पार्टिसिपेट इन एफ एन ओ सो सर लाइक आई थिंक यू नो वॉट वीव ऑलरेडी कवर्ड इन दिस एंटायर सेशन इट्स नॉट जस्ट एफ एन ओ डेटा दैट यू आर गेटिंग सो रेडिली एंड हैंडली अवेलेबल बट यू आर ऑल्सो गेटिंग अ लॉट ऑफ एक्विटी रिलेटेड इन्फॉर्मेशन एज वेल मे बी ओवर व्यू अ हीट मैप अ प्यू टू प्यर कंपेरिजन news may be domestic news global news all these information is readily available maybe you know fid activities any kind of screeners you want technical screeners fundamental screeners it's all available in pro terminal so i think maybe this is a really added advantage to you so after a day or two of fiddling around with it so maybe you can understand exactly how to go about it and what exactly it makes sense according to your e so you can actually make it customizable hence this is the reason why we calling it as a highly customizable trading platform whatever features you want whatever unique parameters you want to see you can customize it and keep it for yourself so this is how it works right so similarly you can also have it for fno the futures and options derivative segment whatever data you require to see it's readily available there right there itself even if you don't want to see it it's still there so this is how i think it's quite useful for you to you know subscribing by subscribing to pro terminal it moving on to the next question Okay, someone is asking, Mr. Abhijit Bolake is asking if we have a pro terminal session again at four thirty p.m. and would it be the same kind of a session? Yes, Mr. Abhijit, this uh, again we would be having another pro terminal session at four thirty p.m. We would be covering the same session that we had just right now, so that you know people who've joined in late or people who've missed it or anyone else who again you want to understand exactly what it meant. So this is the reason why we would be. having another session at 4:30 pm so we are most welcome to log in and understand again the added features the basic features and the advantages of subscribing to pro terminal okay mr manoj kumar thakur is asking if pro terminal is a paid plat paid platform and can i trade with these platform individually swashish would you like to answer this yes of course it is it is a paid uh, paid platform as i've already informed okay that uh, this will cost you 199 as as per the offer and in order to subscribe for it you just have to uh, log into hdfcsec.com go to products under that you will see uh, trading tools in that you just select the first option as pro terminal enter your user credentials as i said it is exclusively for hdfc securities account holder so enter your user credentials and subscribe for it within 48 hours of your amount being paid uh, your pro terminal will be activated okay and uh, he is also asking if he can like trade in it individually so i think obviously it is customizable to every of course user so. every user not i mean to say it is not a, a, a like a, a, which which will be uh, in order to get the access you need to have a your relationship manager or a dealer to place orders this tool is available for you all you have to have just you have to log in any time during the market hours you can lo log in and you can place your orders individually individually in stocks as well as you can do it in future in options as well so all these platforms are available you can as i said it is not only important for uh, fno it is also useful platform for doing equity trading for taking more informed decision and for fno traders definitely it is an advanced platform because on fno section also we have so much of information provided like just we have explained the strategies and the, the future rollovers which will help the investors to take more informed decision right now mr peter is asking if i can view my dmat balance in the watch list i think mr peter watch list is specific to the stocks and not exactly your dmat balance but if you want to go and have a view of your dmat balance you can do that under the reports section so if you click on the reports tab you can have a different uh, you know all the all the open positions net open positions dmat balance so everything is available under the accounts and the reports section so and under the watch list section no it is not available it is available under the account session and if you want a detailed report you can go under the report section so the watch list will only give you a view of the stocks that you want to see or track on a daily basis so that is a difference between your watch list and your dmat account balance 
However, uh, Mr. Peter, let me inform you that under the watch list section, which you have just uh, seen, you can add your, you can see your portfolio as your watch list. That can be done. So not exactly as a DMAT balance, but yes, you can see your portfolio. So let me tell you that uh, how it is. So over to my computer screen now. So under the watch list section, when you click, you can see my holdings as a last option. So here, when you click, your portfolio would be displayed over here. Your portfolio. But if you want to check your DMAT account, then you'll have to go under the accounts, accounts tab. Click and click on DMAT balance. And here, your DMAT balance would be displayed. How many quantities are there? How many are free? Any of them you have put on a, as a collateral or on a hold would be displayed over here. And the available quantity and the LTP. And from right. here also, you can do buy, sell or you can make a hold. Right. So I think this is the difference where you can see your DMAT account balance and your watch list, right? Right. Now, moving on to the next question. Again, Mr. Ranjana is asking the webinar for Pro Terminal. Yes, we have conducted many Pro Terminal webinars before. This is a one more that we've conducted. Again, today we would be having another session at 4.30 p.m. where again, we would be taking you through the details of the Pro Terminal. Right, so now, you can log in for the same. Uh, now this question is asked by Mr. Vijay. He is asking, is Pro Terminal available on the mobile application? So yes, uh, Mr. Vijay, uh, on this mobile application, Pro Terminal mobile application is also available. All you have to do is just go to your Play Store and type in uh, HDFC Securities Pro Terminal. Okay. Uh, once you do that, you can definitely access the Pro Terminal application on mobile app, mobile as well. So that is very much available. However, we will be doing a separate session on mobile application as well. And the features are available. That is also quite user friendly. And a lot of information you get on the go when you are traveling and or when you don't have access to the computer. So yes, it is available. Now, Mr. Yogesh is asking the pro terminal advantages over a regular one. Obviously, sir, you know, you can see in on a, any regular platform, any regular trading platform, you don't have so much detailed data available with you. And even if you do get any kind of data, it is always end of the day data. It's not a real time data. So Pro Terminal is giving you lots of exclusive data features, which is based on real time data, like time to, and accurate decisions as well. So it will help you to take those market decisions that you have very accurately, very profoundly. And uh, this is the advantage that we Pro Terminal is having over a regular kind of a trading platform. So this question has been asked by multiple customers that uh, how can I put a stop loss order or uh, how can I put a stop loss for the trade. So here I would like to inform to all of our viewers that we have a, a product called cover order. So that is an intraday order which allows you to put a stop loss. So the moment you will enter in that cover order you will be I have already done a specific session on cover order as well. But still I'll explain. Uh, so in cover order, you will your first order will be a buy order which will go as per the market. And your second leg would be a sell order that you can put along with a stop loss and a limit price. So the moment it hit that price, automatically your sell order would be triggered. So definitely you can do it. Over to my computer screen, I'll quickly show you how you can place that order. So you just need to click on buy on any of the specific scheme. And then you just need to click on cover. And uh, once you click on cover, the first one will go as market, right? And here you can set the limit price and you can put the trigger price. And the validity will always be a day because it's a cover order is an intraday order. And then you can place the order. The moment the price will hit to the trigger to the limit, automatically your sell order will be activated. And in that will help you to limit your loss. Right, so we'll take the last question. I think let's take a fun question for a change. So Mr. Moon is asking to call him and explain the pro terminals. Sure, we would try to do that. And obviously someone is also asking, how are you? So Ashish, how are you? <laughs> Sorry, so that has been asked by Mr. Vargas. Thank you so much for asking, sir. We are doing absolutely great. I believe today's uh, session was really helpful for you. And um, I all I can say at this point of time is market hours are on. Have a fruitful trading day. And trade like a pro. Thank you. Thank you.